right, Jim Buddhism Total Knowledge Channel here. When you boot up your new computer setup, which is hopefully inside the chassis, you might need to uh, select a boot order. And I will show you today how you select the boot order. Because you can see here, we have a USB drive there. And then we also have two hard drives connected. And, you know, two hard drives. That's going to be complicated. Because if we have two hard drives connected, it uh, means that, well, the computer doesn't automatically know um, if it will boot from USB or which of the hard drives, especially if you have operating systems on each of them. I have operating systems on all of the hard drives including this USB stick. So uh, I need to manually select where to boot from, which we'll do now. So we should just uh, start up the computer there and we'll need to keep a little eye onto the screen here because then we need to be quite quick on the F keys. So uh, it said press F2 or escape to enter the BIOS. And, well, here we are in BIOS. Uh, each BIOS looks a little bit different, but when you are into BIOS, you can from there go to the boot menu. On some computers, you can go directly to the boot menu, and uh, from my experience, it is often uh, you click F9 or F8. One of these is usually, but uh, like in this model, you have to go through BIOS. Anyways, here we have this little screen here, which tells us a lot of funny stuff. Boot menu. Um, and this is, of course, the boot menu. This particular drive has an advanced mood too. So we shall enter this little advanced mood, clicking F7. Just click down that with escape and F7, enter advanced mode because this looks a little bit more like your average BIOS does. It's a very simple setup, the regular BIOS, which is nice. Um, but yeah, it's a kind of old system, by the way, uh, but it's good to show on anyways. And up here, you see we have boot, so we just use the arrow keys to navigate, usually this is the case, or you will have a list of the keys there. So here we have boot configuration, fantastic. Well, we'll just go down to boot option. So, um, and to the boot options here, you can see we have this little thing. We have this little thing. We have this little thing. And uh, you can probably recognize the boot options. Um, this one is the hard drive, which I has the first boot options. This is my install of Linux. Um, and this one, option two, it's the Windows boot option. And this is a Windows install. And this is uh, UEFI. It's Lexar, uh, and that's, of course, the brand name of my uh, USB drive. So on boot option one, you'll just, you know, you click enter, and you can choose which one should, uh, should start first. If it will be this, WDC, this is a hard drive name, um, Windows Boot Manager, which is on another hard drive, you can see D uh, WDC and uh, then we of course can disable it too. So if I want to install a new operative system I would select the Lexar or the jump drive. Uh, the USB uh, device you plug it in to be able to boot, you know, start a new start a new install of a new operative system. You would select that as the first one. But I want to launch um, Windows instead of Linux. So I just click enter on that and uh, there we are. And then it will start Windows first. If that would fail, it will start Linux and last it would start the Lexar. All right, um, and now we can just 
go up there. And ooh, I think, I think not all uh, BIOS has this uh, luxury, but we can actually use the mouse here. Just click exit. And then we, of course, click save changes and reset, which is basically, you know, restart. Yep. And there we go. So now the computer is thinking a little bit and it's thinking, hmm, what should we do? And now we just decided what it should do. I'm not completely sure my uh, current hardware install will uh, launch Windows very successfully because this hard drive, this particular hard drive here is from 2004 or five, I think. Um, I haven't checked the model yet, but um, it's from an older computer, but it's the same standard. So I just stuck it there. Um, what I will do actually is I will check if that graphics card, graphics card, yes, I mean, uh, if it's better than the built-in stuff that's already in. I'm not sure actually. Oh, well, uh, you can see this is the familiar Windows circle there. And <laughs> it's not Friday and it's not 31st of May. Anyways, uh, it seems that um, I indeed can go into my Windows. <laughs> oh Lord, this will be interesting. In any case, um, I hope this little video did uh, help you to understand how to select a boot option. And of course, if you wanted to install something new, you should have it put in your uh, USB drive uh, with your install of your operating systems on there. Uh, I didn't want to do that because I already installed uh, it on one hard drive. Any case, beautiful, beautiful. We have our Windows desktop here, isn't it wonderful? Uh, thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you next time. This is Jimmy Total Notary Channel and we are signing out.